you could just get the stuff the way it was like this morning, like the last stop, it'd be so much better, you know what I mean? But um, I'm not talking to you. I'm on, I'm on the camera. She thought she thought I was talking to her. I'm, I'm using my hands talking to you guys and she's like getting all pissed off and stuff like that. I'm I'm talking on the on the on the camera. We are gonna make a video right now, which is me and you. And you. Okay? Okay. All right. Say hi, YouTube. Hi, YouTube. Oh. So my first stop is right next door, right across the street from my second stop. Never happens local delivery. Never happens. What always happens when you're local delivering somebody is you will have a delivery here, and then the next day or the afternoon you will have a delivery here. But you never have a delivery at the same time. Their gate is locked and their shit's on my tail. They're open. They've been open before too though. So, I think I'm just gonna pull up in here and, and see. And see if they would let me get, dude that's a fucking dock and a half, dude. That's like a fucking hole in the ground. <laughs> I don't even know if I can make that. <clears throat> I can try. Let me see if I honk my horn at them. Yeah, this is an interesting one. This is an, it's like a fucking straight up hole in the ground. Oh man, I hope I don't bottom out on this fucking truck because I got a <clears throat> low step. We'll see. I guess we have no choice. clear it. God, this is scary as fuck, dude. If you guys can only feel... If you can only feel the fucking... The leaning... I'm afraid I'm gonna run into their fucking ramps with my tail. My truck. I'm going to. Yeah, that's as far as I can make it. I can't go any further. I'm gonna run into the tail. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit my bumper to the ramp. They have ramp to lift up your wheels, but my wheels are further forward. I can't go up, so they're just gonna have to pick it off the back. So yeah, due to, due to the fact that I wasn't able to, to back up, we had to hand off low dad, which wasn't that bad. They were a little light, so we just both picked up the thing and slid it to the back, and then he nabbed it with his forklift. Now I gotta pull out of here. And go right there. I'm literally backing into that door right there. <clears throat> that never happens. I'm not even kidding. That never happens. If you're a local driver, you ha you know what I'm talking about. Never happens to where you have a delivery right next door. Well, okay, UPS, sure, FedEx, sure, but like companies like the shit that I work for. These little small time, you know, companies, business owners and stuff like that, never. Yeah, that this was fun. This was awesome because never happens. Another thing that'll happen actually that will happen for local delivery drivers is that like, for instance, I deliver there and another driver from the same exact company from us will deliver right here. Makes no sense whatsoever. That shit happens more than more than you know makes no sense but this was cool i mean two stops technically that's i consider this a one stop you know what i mean because they're right next door to each other i don't consider that two stops on paper it's two stops but i mean really did i really like that's less than i've, I've traveled more distance in a freaking tractor supply to go from one dock to another you know so <laughs> it's not no easy 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 there was never a signal. It says signal at Broadway out of service. There was never a signal on Broadway with this road. Never a signal. I don't understand why there's. A, they say it's out of service. There was never a signal. There was a there was a crosswalk. Maybe that's what they're talking about. But if I remember correctly, that sign was put up before the crosswalk signal was put up. 
And the funny thing is, is obviously Tucson does this shit. You know, they, they do this to where uh, we're gonna put a, we're gonna put a, we're gonna put a crosswalk sign, a hawk light with a flashy lighty thingy in right here. And then guess what we're gonna do? We're gonna tear it all down and redo the whole fucking road. So this way, the road's a lot wider. So we'll just waste your tax money right there. The people who make the laws in Tucson, it's a pain in the ass because like, they literally contradict themselves. Like, hey, uh, so there's a lot of jaywalkers in, uh, in Arizona. What are we gonna do? Well, simple. We'll just make it punishable up to $100. Oh, okay, so if somebody like, you know, jaywalks and, and then I hit them in my car, they're gonna get the ticket? No, no, no. Pedestrians have the right of way no matter what. Okay, so, but they were jaywalking. Exactly, they were jaywalking. Yeah, but, but if they jaywalked and, and I hit them, then you get the ticket because they have the right of way. So when would a pedestrian actually get a ticket for jaywalking? There's gotta be nobody around them ever, ever. So if there's no cars on the road and they jaywalk, then they will get a ticket. Okay, but how are they gonna get a ticket if there's nobody around to see them jaywalk? A cop will give them a ticket. Yeah, but then if the cop is there and sees them jaywalking across the street, then what? The cops gotta give them the right of way so they can cross the street. So would they get a ticket then? Nope, because they have the right of way. You see how contradicting the fucking laws are? No reason why I say anything is because when you go to the U of A, you know, people jaywalk all the fucking time and it irritates the shit out of me because they'll come out of nowhere. Like the damn buildings are like right next to the road so you don't even see them until they're like oh there they are walking in front and they don't give a shit they will walk right out in front of a fucking 80,000 pound semi because they're like uh, hoo, 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 we got the right away we got the right away so this, this is a great example of what I was talking about about delivering in the same place at the same time and it never happens you either do it later in the day or the next day yesterday I delivered right over there, that building, not this one, but that one right there, delivered over there towards the end, dropped it off. Today, I'm delivering right here. And it's just one of those things. It's like, damn, man, you know, if we could just get the stuff the way it was, like this morning, like the last stop, it'd be so much better, you know what I mean? But um, I'm not talking to you. I'm on, I'm on the camera. Thought, she thought I was talking to her. I'm, I'm using my hands talking to you guys, and she's like getting all pissed off and stuff like that. I'm, I'm talking on the, on the, on the camera. I wasn't talking to her. <laughs> People automatically. So that's the thing that sucks about truck driving. You cannot make a fucking hand gesture without somebody getting pissed off, because they automatically think that you're talking to them. You know what I mean? Like you make, you make any type of hand gesture at all whatsoever, and. They think you're they think you're talking about them. I'm not talking to you. I'm not talking about you. I'm not talking to me. Now I'm talking about you because you're getting all fucking pissed off for no fucking reason. Don't assume the world revolves around you. I wasn't hand gesturing towards you. I'm talking because I'm talking with my hands. You, people just you you're a truck driver, you can you stay exactly the way you are. Do not move. Do not make a hand gesture. Do not make any type of movements whatsoever. Do not smile or wave at anybody because they will be upset at you. Make sure you are 10 and 2 at all times. Do not ever make any type of movement whatsoever towards any of the four wheelers because they will call you in and they will get upset because you just slightly moved your hand to scratch your face. Got to stay exactly still. Cannot move. Do not look at anybody. Do not make eye contact. 10 and 2 at all times. Try to make a turn without moving your hands. No, nope, can't do it. <laughs>